Hey everybody, it's Crazy Guitar 4 and welcome back to some more Super Mario Odyssey. In the last episode, we chilled in Dark Side and did quite a bit actually. We had a, a whole Brutals boss rush with it and all ending off with the Mecha Brood. Um, and we got some more pieces of hint art, quite a, quite a lot actually, a whole 10 pieces in just one kingdom. And finally we got... Uh, a lot more done in Dark Side. We basically finished up all of Dark Side. Um, we did like some sub areas and get, got moons through there. Uh, so yeah, just a lot of stuff was done in Dark Side. And um, and now we made our way back to Cap Kingdom. Where in this episode we're gonna be starting um, our I guess collectathon, uh, the collectathon phase of Mario Odyssey. And I'm excited about it because I like it a lot. It's, I was like, can we just talk about how these birds in Cap Kingdom literally have hats on them? That's adorable. I love that. All right, but um, yeah, now that we are um, back in action, is there... I do not have checkpoints except that one? Damn, that's rough. Okay, you know what? But let me do something real quick. Hi, Luigi. How are you doing? Haven't seen you since Mushroom Kingdom. I guess I'll grab these real quick. So things have now been unlocked here in uh, Cap Kingdom since we've, you know, finished the game off. So that's exciting. I like that a lot. Let's go ahead and grab a new outfit for today's episodes. We don't really have enough coins for one of the purple coin outfits, so let's chill with one of these. What's a good one? There's a lot of them, too. Sheesh. Fashionable, we got pirate, clown, football, classic, the skeleton. <laughs> Better to go bankrupt after that. You know, off of this one. Uh, Luigi, Doctor, Waluigi, Diddy Kong. Okay, only the hat, though. It was, which is interesting. And then the, all the DLC. Okay. Ooh, what could I rock in today's episode? Um, fun fact, actually, some of these uh, costumes you can actually get through Amiibo. Like the classic uh, stuff you can get through, like, certain Mario Amiibo. Uh, the Luigi outfit you can get through Luigi Amiibo. This one through Dr. Mario Amiibo. This one with the Waluigi Amiibo. Obviously, the Diddy Kong stuff with the Diddy Kong Amiibo. It's like anything like that. There are like a few Amiibo that are actually, um, you know, available to be... I also forgot to buy this. That are available to be gotten um, or to be used in the game that gives you outfits without having to like pay for the outfits, which is exciting. I like that a lot. Um, but I don't have all those Amiibo. <laughs> I only have the Mario Odyssey, like, themed ones. Which I'll, I'll do, like, I'll probably showcase later on. For now, though, um, I guess we'll rock Fashionable. I wouldn't mind that. Let's do it. Let's go with the Fashionable outfit in today's episode. Okay, let's grab this one. Okay, let's change. Okay, and now with that, let's see how Mario looks. Beautiful. Uh, absolutely amazing. Okay. So I think first off, it might be smart. Son of a gun. It might honestly be really smart to go ahead and head to that uh, rock over there uh, because Cappy's like, hey, that's kind of crazy. You should probably go check it out. We're going to be going there through the use of Paragoombas. I'm pretty sure this is our first time actually using Paragoombas in the Let's Play. So that's pretty cool. That's actually really fun, too. I mean, they're basically just like, just like the Goombas mixed with the flying dry bones, so... Yeah. So if we get over here and uh, hit this moon rock... Fun fact with this moon rock is that you can't... Hold up. You can't, like, ground pound into... So many power moons popped out. That rock must have fallen from the moon. Well, cool. I mean, that's what I was. That's what I wanted to do. Wait, wait, wait! I thought you couldn't. Hold up. I'm so confused because I'm used to it being a thing of you couldn't um hit those moon rocks. Unless it was with Cappy specifically like I remember back then I tried like ground pounding and like it just wouldn't work You can you can ground pound you can like dive into it nothing. It would just not work. You can only use Cappy Am I like old now or something and they just like they change things? I don't know Okay, but yeah, so those are moon rocks and 
each kingdom, or at least each of the major kingdoms, um, no, no, actually each kingdom has them, excluding uh, Mushroom and Dark. And they basically just give you um, more options, or just give you more moons to collect. So Cap Kingdom gave us quite a bit, actually, even with it being like a decently small kingdom. Um, so you can kind of imagine how much, like, for example, Dark Side will give us. Like, that one's gonna give us a crap ton of moons, uh, from the Moon Rock. Which I'm excited. No, I'm sorry, I'm not da <laughs> Dark Side? What? I'm, 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 yeah. I am an idiot for saying Dark Side. What I meant to say was Sand Kingdom, because <laughs> that's a good example of a lo rather large kingdom. I don't know why the hell I said Dark Side. Probably because I just got done freaking recording Dark Side. That's probably it. Which was actually a pretty good episode overall. I I'm very happy with how that one turned out. So, yeah. There's a I know there's like a stupid freaking bird around that I have to catch, but I just don't know where the hell he is. Where is that son of a gun? Does he like go around this way? Like, I'm pretty sure he like flies this way, but he comes from here. But I just don't know where. Where is that scumbag? I want to get him real quick. Because, like, I'm not going to forget, but it's just going to be annoying having to try and, like, chase him. Oh, I see him, I see him, I see him. You see that? See that slimy son of a gun? I see him, Soren. I see him, Soren. Is he going to go all the way around? Or is... Nope, no, he's not. No, he's not. Got your chief, got your chief. Yeah. Easy. Easy. It's just a waiting game, but you know what? It was um, a worthwhile waiting game. So what can I do? I mean, there's so much to do in Cap Kingdom. Uh, first, actually, let's read the brochure because we haven't done that yet. Cap Kingdom, home of tradition, pr propri propriety, and hats. I've never heard of the word propriety before, so that's new. Um, Bonneton, a land of haberdash dreams. Population middling, size smallish, locals, bonneters. Currency, hat shape, industry, hats, and airships, and temperature around 71 degrees. 71 is actually pretty good. Mushroom Kingdom was good with 81, but 71 might be more my style. All right. Uh, so we got extreme mobile homes. You might mistake them for giants top hats. That's kind of funny. Uh, we got world best hat stand. Architecture protrudes from the fog. And po posts that stand out. These wooden posts are used as partitions or stoppers. If they get in your way, you can pound them down, but pulling them out is recommended. All right, and we got the map of here, of, uh, of the place. We're looking kind of clean. And we got one all the way off in the distance. I think I know which one that is. I got the second part. A spectacle of a bridge, the distinctively double arched bridge. All right. Oh yeah, that bridge, that's right. Old fashioned lighting. They also look a bit like hat stands. <laughs> they do. I mean, it's cap game for a reason. Everything's got to be cap um, or hat uh, themed. And the sometimes bridge. Bridges waves go off a sea of fog. The three keys to the kingdom appreciate the distinctive architectural d style based on hat silhouettes. Enjoy the romantic glow of the moonlit, fog shrouded streets. Chat with the kind and ever courteous monitors. Not bad. If you want to read any of that stuff, highly recommend just like pausing it at some point when I was like zooming on them. Uh, but yeah, so that's that. Nice little, uh, uh, how do I explain it? I guess. Synopsis? Uh, yeah, synopsis works. Of, of Cap Kingdom. I like that. Let's grab... Actually, no, let's not even grab you yet. Or again, because I'm gonna go into the hat door. And take care of whatever is inside. <laughs> what we got? Oh, I remember this one! Okay, I, I, yeah, this one's, this one's alright. So, obviously the idea is, uh, moon shards. Oh, yes, we can use the frogs again. I love these guys. Man, isn't it crazy how... Hold up. When was the last time I, I used the frogs? There's no way it was first episodes. There can't be- it can't be that long. But I think it might have been. I think it literally has been since the first episodes since I last used one of these frogs. That's kind of nuts if you if you ask me. That's a lot of time. Is there anything over here or is it just coins? I think it's just coins. Um, there's something down here though. There's another frog. Froggy! Uh, there's... Okay, let's get this moon shard over here, because I missed it. Because I went for a higher one, um... Or just a little bit higher. First. Uh, now I remember there's, like, one... Ugh, I hate that. The frogs are fun to use, but they are a little bit finicky, I will say that. 
What was I thinking about? It was, yeah, right here. Okay. Jump in. Beautiful. Hold on. Ah, I messed up again. I can't even collect the coins. <laughs> Damn. Frogs be too short. That's the issue. Okay. Jump high. You shake the controller to like jump real high. And it's very fun to do that. I'm very useful getting to like certain parts. Um, that's the secret moon, so I'm gonna grab that. Hold up, let's grab this real quick. Cause, come on, really? That's that's embarrassing. Easy. Okay, let's go upsy daisies, and let's go again. It's fine. Okay, you know what? Let's just, let's just go for the secret moon real quick. <laughs> yeah, since we're already up here, secrets of the frog pond. It's gonna be a, kind of a nice place to chill if you're a frog. I dig it. I'm not a frog myself, but if I was a frog, I would definitely like to chill in this area, in this in this little room. You know, very seems very very enjoyable. All right, yeet! And now it's time to just collect the moon and get out of here. Not bad. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Oh, Cap Kingdom's fun. It's it's nice actually being able to explore Cap Kingdom and like actually doing a lot of stuff within uh, the kingdom because. I mean, like, it was, it kind of, it kind of sucked just having to, um, barely spend any time here in the Cap Kingdom, uh, when we originally came here, uh, you know, in the first episodes. So it's nice actually being able to do stuff, you know, it's, it's exciting, it really, it really is. Uh, actually, you know what I'm gonna do real quick? I'm gonna go over here because Peach is over here, what? <laughs> Hello, Peach. Oh, Mario, glad to see you're still traveling. Tiara and I have decided to take a trip all around the world. It'd be nice, it'll be nice to see all these places we visited before, but on our own terms. Tiara told me she just loves how the ships at home look like hats. Isn't the scenery here just breathtaking? The people here are so gracious. I was given a power moon, but you can take it. So Peach, um, as she explains, is going to be in every single kingdom you have visited throughout the game. That includes some of the detours too, like Cloud Kingdom, Lost Kingdom, Ruin Kingdom. She's going to be in those as well. Uh, so that's cool. I wonder if it's true that dinosaurs enjoy basking in the sun. It'd be fun to ask one. Well, there's one place where there's a lie of dinosaur, so <laughs> we'll be checking that out later, but not now. So yeah, Peach is going to be a, a moon uh, that you have to worry about. Uh, collecting in each kingdom, so keep that in mind. Uh, oh, hint art, hello. Okay, so we got. Uh, let me just yeah, let's get that out of the way. Boom, got another piece of hint art. The first one of, uh, of Cap Kingdom. I actually forgot uh, for a good bit there what exactly Cap Kingdom's hint art uh, would lead me to. Okay, now I remember this too. Good to see you again, Cappy. Say, Cappy, you mentioned a treasure a ways back. Said I could have it if I found it. Does that deal still stand? All right, this is an important moon. Where was it again? Was it under that pile of wooden crates? So it's the one we broke. Or, no, it's actually it's this one. It was broken, but not not anymore. Just wait a second. Let me break it again. Boom. No. Maybe the narrow pathway that dips into the fog. This one always confused me, but it's actually this place right over here that he's talking about. Not here. Maybe on top of Glass's Bridge. I wonder. Okay. So, uh, by top of Glass's bridge, that's this one over here, I'm more than positive. But like, what do you mean by top of it? Hold on, let me just very quickly just see if he means like up there, up there. Let's double check. There's a moon just like chilling down there, so I'll grab that in a sec. Okay, so he's not talking about this. Um, I get, you know, hold up, I'm, I'm, or yeah, I'm already here, so might as well just get this moon, <laughs> which is nice. Uh, I feel like there's gonna be a lot of moons like that. Well, is there? Maybe. Maybe not. So probably top of Glass's bridge, he just means like over this way. Like here or something? No? Wait. Or is it that bridge? That might be the bridge he's talking about. Hold up, now, now I'm ge getting confused. Mario, please. Now I'm getting confused on what he means by Glass's bridge. I think he means like over here. That would make the most amount of sense to me. Okay, no. Oh, what? What? What do you mean top of glassic bri- class- la, la 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 What do you mean top of glasses bridge? I was literally there. Come on, come on, Cappy. There. No, okay. Maybe on one of- top of the biggest hill? Uh, biggest hill's gonna be over there. I see some coins. So let's grab them and just- oh my gosh, a freaking bunny. Ugh. I hate those moons so much. They suck. 
The one in uh, Moon Kingdom and Peach's Castle went, or uh, Mushroom Kingdom went that bad. Her, okay, I uh, first went towards the moon. All right, let's go towards the moon. Okay, what's he gonna say now? We're so close, we're so close. Is it like right here or something? I remember, it's right under the spot. And there's the moon. So there we have it, the forgotten treasure. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, so it's a little bit of a, a trek. The glasses bridge thing was confusing the heck out of me for like no reason, but at least we got that figured out. Um, is there any, I feel there's a few things I can still do with uh, the Paragoomba, so I'm gonna do that. Uh, first off, actually this over here, I'm gonna shake the controller because I think I fly, yeah, I fly much faster. We got some musical notes to worry about, which is exciting. Oh, I remember this one. This one's, uh, this one's okay, as long as you like keep a steady height the whole time. That's that. Okay, that was actually really easy, <laughs> but I don't mind. I do not mind at all. Isn't it gonna be like? Yeah, you see that? See the moon all the way in the top right? I figured that there was gonna just be a moon lying down on like a, an I like guess almost out of bounds uh, signpost. I like the the skull in the sign. Be like, oh, you do not want to be here. To be fair though, who would even be out here in the first place unless they're getting this moon? <laughs> let's just let's just think about that, you know? Okay, you know what? I'm say let's just say screw it. I'm gonna go ahead. I'm sorry, Goomba, my child. Sorry, I wronged you. Let me go ahead and f get this freaking rabbit. Where where did he go? He was just here. There he is. Okay, how much of a pain are you going to be? Um, not too terrible. He just kind of goes around the hills. Get, oh my gosh, okay. Remember when I said not to terrible? I was capping. There we go. You just kinda have to juke him. That's all you gotta do. Ha hopping near the ship. I almost, I thought that said shop for a second. I was very confused about, about that because that, that was not the shop. <laughs> that was not the shop, chief. Okay, let's grab the frog because he's gonna be needed uh, for another moon. So that's cool. I don't mind uh, playing as the frog again. <laughs> he's fun as heck, so you know, that's exciting. Um, you know, if it's a fun capture, then it's worth playing that capture. Okay, I know it's gonna be like right over here. So let's go ahead and hit this stuff first. See what this gives me. Hello, bird. I already got you, so I don't have to worry about you, thankfully. Oh, gosh. Stop, please. Hit that. There's another. That is, is stop. Oh my gosh, the frog is so finicky. He's like slippery. That's what I hate. Here? Beautiful, okay. Frog jumping above the fog. Is it worth jumping? Uh, theoretically. Okay, you know what? I'm not even gonna, I don't wanna kill the frog. I don't wanna kill little frog. It's not worth it. Okay, what do we have to do? I think we're done with like this whole area. That's cool. Um, There's like two right over there. There's three actually over here. Uh, we got three over here. Oh wait, Koopa free running is a moon um, rock thing? Huh, I guess I'm just kind of used to it being a part of the main kingdom. I just post game kingdom because of, uh, you know, Mushroom Kingdom, how it was just like there. But actually, before we go to that, let me go down here. So I'm pretty sure there is something here. Uh, nothing there, but in here, I know for a fact. Never mind, I'm stupid. It's in here. <laughs> it's in here. <laughs> Some purple coins. How far are we? Hmm. 18 away. Not bad, not bad. <sighs> okay. Oh, I remember this one. This one's not terrible, but it's not super, like, enjoyable either. Hit. Yeet! Wow, I actually got that. I'm surprised. Hold up. Um... Watch this. Boom! Easy. Easy. That was number two? What the freak is number one? It's probably, like, up there or something. That's my guess. Okay, um, you're important right here. This is, like, the same thing with the Toad in Mushroom Kingdom, right? What do you say? I'm protecting this Paramoon, but I'm not afraid of anything, not even Paragoombas. Well, that kind of just tells you what you need to do. <laughs> uh, let me grab a Paragoomba real quick. Where is a... Oh, that was not super accessible. That one kind of is. Oh, this is risky as heck. Okay, not even a problem. Oh, unless I fall off like an idiot. You know, that's, that's more than likely gonna happen. Okay. So with this one being kind of low, I think- Ooh, this one's actually kind of low, hold up. How the heck do I- Because the issue with the Paragoombas, and a lot of ones that are dependent on flight, I think it's only an issue with Paragoombas. 
um, where you have to like get them to if you want them to fly higher you have to get them to a higher altitude um, and then you know you can actually go to higher places all right and boom same thing <laughs> he's just like what <laughs> did you know I was scared of Paragoombas but yeah I, I knew you're lying from uh from the moment I saw you okay let's see uh it's, it's already over here so I'll take care of it why the absolute heck not? What is this one? Oh, it's, I was I was thinking about this one earlier. I don't know why, but I was just kind of thinking about this one. I kind of hate this one, just because of the secret moon, or just not the secret, but the side moon. Okay, we're fine. That one was not even that bad. <laughs> Precision rolling is very correct. All right. So the fun thing about this is that you cannot stop rolling no matter how hard you try. You will just keep rolling. I mean, you can kind of like. St Ooh. Holy crap, that was so close. You can... Oh, I messed up. Should've done the boost uh, a little later. Like, right off the edge or something. But, um... You cannot stop rolling no matter how hard you try. You can hit the spiny, but then you'll go right into rolling right afterwards. It's kind of it's a fun one, honestly. I like it. Kind of reminds me of that sliding uh, place. That sliding moon you gotta get. Not moon, but power shine and sunshine. I remember this is important, right? Where is it at? Is it that? Was it that? No, stop, Daniel! I didn't want to do that. Please hit. What? Wait, what's the move? Zoom in again? Oh, why? That's right. Where are you at? Yeah, you see that taxi over there? That's what you got to focus on. It's it's kind of like one of those things of um, you know, what's what's one thing that's not like the others, and you spot it, and it's like, hey, you get a moon for that. I know a few kingdoms have something like that. Not all, definitely, but a few, for sure. So I'm gonna be sh I'm gonna make sure to get those. I mean, we're trying to 100% the game, so I would assume I'll, I probably will get those. Is there anything else to really do here? Not really. That's kind of everything. Okay, we're actually making really good progress, and we're only like what 22 episodes? <laughs> episodes? Whoa, 22 minutes in. Also, I just realized this one would have been much smarter to get <laughs> for that one. Okay, never mind. Doesn't matter. Let's. Okay, here's the other one. Let's grab this real quick, because I kind of want coins. Hello. There we go. Grab that. What's this one? Oh, I remember. Okay. Uh, let's do that. That was bad. Boom. Okay. So I just got to roll like crazy, honestly. Go, go. Shake Mr. Controller. E, E, E. Stop, stop, stop. Okay. <laughs> that freaking bonk. Every time. That's always an issue, and I don't know why. I don't. Okay. At least that's that taken care of. Uh, so I guess let's head in. Or should I end things off now? Because how much are we? How we, do we have left? Eleven moons left, and we did it. We literally got twenty moons in this one episode. Oof. We only have eighteen purple coins left. I don't think there are any left in the uh, in like every place I've been to. I think it's just mainly in like the 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 next sub area and then higher than that. I, I think I'm comfortable if anything's off for today. Yeah, yeah, I think we'll do that. So, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Super Mario Odyssey. In the next one, we'll continue our um, exploration of uh, Cap Kingdom. And collect some more moons, you know, finish that off more than likely. And uh, also more than likely get all purple coins. So, I feel like Cap Kingdom will be finished next episode. So, stay tuned for that. Um... Yeah, so subscribe, like, comment, all that good stuff. Social media, including Twitch, the second channel, the music channel, and the VOD channel are all down below in the description. And I'll be seeing you guys next time. Pop-Tart out.